This grass has grown beautifully. The clovers. Here you can see. This is coxfoot. White clover. There's different kinds of grasses in here. Dandelions, plantains, yarrow, sheep's parsley. And here you can see this is one kind of clover, and then this is another kind of clover down here. Here's another kind of clover, its leaves are different. And look, they know that they're being moved. Here's, this is a purple clover. Some hawksweed. can see I'm moving to this gate. What are you guys at? Dink a dink. Okay, you guys ready for a feast? A scrum umptious feast? Yeah. 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 excitement. Here you can see how to see different clovers. This clover here has these little white bits in its, um, on its leaves. Then you come over here, and this clover, the texture of the leaves are kind of hairy, but you see there's no white bits. This is a kind of purple clover here. You can see the purple clover. And this over here is another kind of purple clover. Here's the baby flower, which is beautiful. It's, it looks like a soft pom-pom. And here is the mature flower that bees will love. And its leaves have a lovely texture. They're kind of, it's like a hairy clover. I think it might even be called the hairy clover. So this is a second purple clover. Then this is another kind of clover. You can see how the white is going around the leaves, the edges of the leaves, or kind of into the leaves, like the crescent on your nail. So those are three different clovers just right there. And then like you can see the different dandelions. This is one kind of dandelion with the teeth and the oval top of the leaf. 
And then you see this kind of dandelion, which has teeth all the way along. So you can see there's the two different um, dandelions. So when I'm talking about multi-species swords, it can be like many different kinds of clovers and many different kinds of dandelions, like rye grasses. There's many different kinds of rye grasses, both cultivated and non-cultivated. Look at that, right there is loads of dandelions rich within the grasses. So that's just some of the uh, varieties that are in here. Then if you look here, this is, not quite sure who that is. That, I think that's a trefoil. No, it's um, a, um, the yellow clover. So that's a yellow clover there. Then here's a little white flower. And I think this is one of the, oh, I, get, I can't think of what it is. It, it might be in the family of the crane's bill, I think. No, I don't think it is in the family of the crane's bill. And then you have uh, this daisy. And this is all within me just kneeling on the ground here in a very, very uh, tiny area that uh, all these different species are. And in the grasses, you can see some are thicker, some are bluer, some are thinner, some are uh, they're, they're different kind of shapes to the grasses. So that is what a mixed sward kind of looks like, is all different kinds of plants all mixed in together. And like the hawksweed or uh, dandelion family, there's many different variants, just like there's many different clovers here from these purple clovers here with the dits in them, to these with the plain leaves that are furry, to these with the kind of like fingernail half moon whites on them. And that's just a few of the different species that um, I have here. And you can see the sheep are enjoying coming out into this field, all munching away.